Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video here on this channel. My name is Yola and today I'm going to react to Nodio Kul, which is part of Cook Studio Bangla season 2 and it's performed by Ripon, Idris and Arnob. The song hasn't been out for even a day but it has already gathered half a million views which is amazing. And yes, I'm once again excited but this time I'm especially excited because we have Arnold performing. And if you've been following Cox Studio Bangla since the beginning from season one, you might remember that Arnob appeared in various performances from the first season sometimes as um, in the background as a session musician or even as the main artist for a performance and in season one he performed one song together with Ripon and now this duo is once again reunited for Coxi Bangla season two and we even have another artist Idris joining this performance. Really looking forward to this because I also haven't spotted Arnob in this season so far. Yes, in the credits we were able to spot him, but has he appeared in any of the previous videos? I think he didn't. If he did, let me know because I really was looking um, at the videos and I couldn't spot him. Anyways. Sorry guys, I have to take a little break here because there is a big train passing my place making a little bit of noise <sighs> okay i think i will continue because this train is really really long and i don't have time to wait until the train is passing anyways we're going into this description now from the song it says as inhabitants of this beautiful delta our lives have been forever bound with rivers yes so back in the days in geography class i can i i can recall that when we learned about you know asian countries we also touched a little bit on bangladesh and i think the main thing that my teacher mentioned was about how many rivers bangladesh has and this huge delta of rivers especially at the tip of the country in the south if you would show me just this delta just the delta itself i would straight away tell you this is Bangladesh, this is, this is it. So this is what we learned geography wise, that there's a lot of rivers and that life is really depending on these rivers. And for ages, river have given life as much as it has poised the fear of uncertainty. But that's the beauty of Bangladesh. This beautiful string of emotion that binds us to the rivers is real magic. Okay, I'm currently lost in his description. So it looks like it's gonna, it's like an ode to the delta, to the river. Uh, so what I could catch also now from this description is that Idris is a clarinet artist, that he's a clarinet player. Fun fact about me, I played instruments when I was a kid, but one instrument I always wanted to learn but never did is the clarinet because the clarinet for me is one of my favorite instruments i don't know out of sudden i think when i was a teenager it just grew on me I, I started loving the sound so much and i also wanted to learn how to play it but this never happened so maybe in the next few years when i have more time on my hands hopefully i can actually start learning how to play the clarinet it's actually a dream of mine even though I'm not sure how this will work out, but yeah, super excited to see a clarinet player to be one of the main artists here. Super looking forward to this. I'm also really looking forward to Ripon's voice because if you've watched this reaction of mine and even if you have seen this um, performance in general, you will know how amazing and how special his voice was. I don't know. It just was something for me especially totally different something beautifully new i can't wait so yeah nine minutes long i can't wait for it let's watch it let's enjoy this together let's dive into it Oh. 
house is on fire this season. Are you kidding me? Tissue somewhere. <laughs> I'm out of tissues again. I don't know what it is about his voice, but there's so much emotion. He can capture and I also love to see the Coca-Cola um, logo in Bangla script. And also, I can tell they all have in these big, wide shawls. Like, what's, is there a connection between, what's the connection between this performance and these shawls? Because I think we've never seen these shawls in, in a previous performance. So all of them have more traditional look. Just hear this, it's just so beautiful. I think I mentioned this before. Look at this shot. 
relax. Just the set design is so minimal but so on point with the topic and it just sets the whole atmosphere. It's just crazy how good this is. This guy is on fire this season. It's just small details, but it just adds up so much. This is such a beautiful effect, I can't. Okay, I have a, okay, um, where do I start here? I'm, I'm still, my thoughts are a little bit over the place, even though this was a very calming and soothing song, still my thoughts are like racing and I have a lot of thoughts in my head. First of all, very soothing, so calming, nine minutes long, and yet it didn't feel like nine minutes. It just felt like this. And it was so incredibly beautiful. It was stunning something completely unexpected yet something i don't know but so beautifully captured just the song alone was stunning it was very simplistic though however i loved it and this simplicity just was the theme of the song yet all the instruments all the wood instruments really really did a great job in capturing this emotion and the percussionist 
As I already said, he's on fire this season. He is adding so many details to the songs. The little splashing of water, I really enjoyed that. I also love the set design how minimalistic it was, how everything was blue, saturated, the whole light situation, everyone dressed in white, I think was also very fitting. And yes, um, as I already mentioned, whilst I was watching this song, why were they wearing all these white shawls? Because I haven't seen these shawls in another um, video before. So really amazing detail. I also love the saris of the ladies. They look, I mean, those ladies, they always look stunning. Come on. <laughs> they always look stunning. They always sing beautiful with their beautiful voices. What can I say? It's just, once again, proves that Coq Studio Banga is doing the right thing and is simply blowing us away and uh, can't wait what else there is going to be this uh, season it's so amazing to see and this was so emotional again I just love when songs can trigger your emotions and can make you feel a certain way for me this is something really really special and I honestly love it when songs can do this to you yeah anyways thank you so much for watching this video i really hope you enjoyed it if you did give it a thumbs up leave a comment below this video if you enjoyed it and i hope i will see you very soon in the next video until then stay happy and stay healthy bye